You certainly don't want to leave your electronics out in this kind of heat, unless that is, of course, you want a costly repair. And 13 Action News reporter Tom George right now is live explaining really the serious damage that these high temperatures can do to our devices. Yeah, well, there's a little bit of a breeze right now, but it's still pretty sunny, but it's still nice enough to where people are actually playing outside. But don't let the nice breeze at this hour fool you. It's still pretty hot. In fact, especially in your car, you can see right now it's still just degrees away from causing a lot of damage to your phone. When it's this hot, you might see this warning pop up on your phone. I just got that the other day. It told me that I had to wait till it calmed down or it, it cooled down for me to use it. A warning to cool it down before things get worse. I actually put mine in the refrigerator for a little bit. With temperatures this hot, it doesn't take long to cause a lot of damage. Check this out. This is a normal battery, but just half an hour to an hour in the car can cause all this bubbling and a lot of problems. One of the most uh, common issues that I see is people will come in with their battery expanding and the battery will expand and actually cause their screen to crack. In fact, it only takes 95 degrees for the heat to begin to hurt your phone. In extreme cases where a phone is left out for a long period of time, the battery can even explode. But what about if you just accidentally leave your phone in the car? Even a little heat can still cause some issues with charging your battery. It can cause your uh, wireless charging to completely stop working or slow it down. So if you don't want a trip for a costly repair, make sure you keep your phone by your side when you get out of the car. It's getting hotter every single day. Now another quick piece of advice they have is even if you're driving in the car and you think it's not a problem, if you're still in direct sunlight, that can still be a problem. A lot of people have those uh, mounted phone uh, on their dash, especially if you drive for ride share or something like that, where you have your phone mounted on the dash. They say if it's in direct sunlight, you can still get that kind of damage even when you're driving behind the wheel. Reporting live, Tom George, 13 Action News.